Hey Tubies. Hey, 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 Tubies. 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 Anyways, um, post Tiffany again, and still wearing this green shirt, and it's still Thursday, still the urge today, and there's positives to this day, wealth, and earthiness, and admiration, but there's also things like materialism, even being greed, so, um, this is sacred to the earth, the planet. It's sacred to um, the Lady Fortuna, the Lady of Fortune. Um, my lady, my lady. <laughs> um, some even say that it's Legba's Day, Thursday. Uh, uh, when I just barely got into with Legba, into a relationship, that's what I had heard was um, Thursday, but then I heard from someone else Monday, and that fit, fit a little better in my schedule, so <laughs> it was better. Um, Persephone, she asked, creative uses for Florida water. So I'm just give you one quick, quick use for Florida water. I'm trying to look for a bottle. Some kind of bottle. Mm, I don't have one. But the thing you're going to do is take. I just talked about Ruth, so I'm going to talk about it a little bit more. Ruth. Um, the. Kamaruta? Kamaruta? Something like that. Kimaruda, the Kamaruda. I'm gonna put a link below to it. And um, to a link to that site below on the thing. And it's really nice. It's a protective charm, prosperity charm. It's, uh, it's a very protective charm. My priest and all his little children, um, not little children, but they're all grown. Love you, Michael and Jasmine, and, um, Michael, Jasmine, and all of my other circle, <laughs> from my circle and everything, um, anyways, back on to the topic, um, to this topic, about, uh, what was the top of Rue? Now, Rue is a very, very... I'm going to set the Rue plant over here. So, y'all just take a good look at it. Um, Rue is a very good plant. It's very fragrant. Uh, for some people, it would be foul smelling. But for... At first, it was, I kept saying it was nasty smelling. But it's not nasty. Mm. Only the fresh ones smell to that. But it's kind of savory. It got a savory smell. And make sure you don't get none of the oils on your skin because some people might be irritated to it. And I'm actually irritated to it. This one, when I put my nose, when it touch my nose, I'm uh -huh. mm. Um, Most people are irritated by the thing because the oil actually kind of burns the skin a little bit. That's only if direct sunlight, so it's not really burning your skin, so don't worry about it. This is a good, safe plant to use. Um, I don't know about a safe plant to eat, <laughs> but I know a lot of Mexicans have it outside the house, so it has to be a safe plant some kind of way. Um, and not to be racial or, you know, ra or whatever, <laughs> you know, bringing race into this, but I just know that a lot of Mexicans, a lot of Italians have this in their house, have this in or outside their house in the garden somewhere, 
And if they don't, you'll find it around their house somewhere. <laughs> um, and if you don't know where to find it, ask tu abuelita, it means uh, your grandmother, um, what this herb is, and she'll show up tell you. Um, that's if you are of a Mexican Spanish descent. Okay, so you got you got the rue, and rue is a very protective. I told you about that in the last video. I'm just going on about rue. Um, rue, is, I love rue. Rue is my favorite. Um, now, when I first found it, it wasn't so much my favorite, but now it is. Um, because I realized that it has such magical properties. Um, and then. So, I'm just going to stop saying, um, because that's just interrupting my trade of thought. Alright, so, Rue is a very protective plant of your money, your finances, all purpose, all way, all, um, all around protection herb. So, you put it in anything, it will protect your love, your, um, money, your house, your children, your... Uh, your relationship, your heart, your emotions, um, it just will just protect everything. Um, I guess that's all I could say about Rue. And one thing that I know about Rue is you could take, you could dry this and put this inside of a Florida water. I don't have that much Florida water in here, but, uh, you could take this and put it inside Florida water. Add some more water if you would like. Well, let it be dry when you do this. <laughs> um, take some room, put it in Florida water. Now me, I'm gonna take one of these cedar tips because it makes it little smell a little bit better. Um, which it already has a smell, so you just might want to just put this in there already. Because it's actually a floral type smell. I don't know what kind of smell. It just smells like Florida water. Nothing else smells like it. Um, you could put this inside of a Florida water and it makes root water through. And you would wash your door, wash your house, wash your knobs your door knob, well, even wash your hands with it, um, like I said, direct sunlight would actually burn it, I've never actually got burned by using it in direct sunlight, so I've never actually applied it directly to the skin, but I've applied it to the skin with Florida water and it hasn't been burning at all, it just smells like roof, um, in Florida water, <laughs> uh, some other creative uses with Florida water, okay, Remember the bottle spell? Remember that? It actually has Florida water in it. And that's what I filled it up with, this Florida water. And then I leave the leave it uncapped and then it evaporates. Uh mm, this smells good. And then it evaporates out and I leave it uncapped when I sleep. Put it back when I wake up. Um, if I want, I can just add some more Florida water to it, which I'm not going to do. It just actually a spell, and I want it to go to an end, so it gives me all of my results, so I can start the next spell. Um, <laughs> it might seem a little selfish of me, but yeah, i got to start the next spell. And you can't really do an how-to video, because I already have one how-to already up. Um, this how to already up so when this one gets done I would do a how to on this on how to make one of these or how to do one of these um what you would oh I've already done this sorry <laughs> I've already done a video on this but what you do is add herbs and you add Florida water that's a creative use and you if you want to add aromatic herbs 
um, make floor bath waters um, with floor water. I add roses to floor water um, to create. Well, I always dilute floor water with water because I only have such a little bit of it. So, and this is no no better. <laughs> um, you know, and I only have such a little bit of it, so I always dilute it with water. Um, if you want another creative use for Florida water, you can actually go to my Ultra Potion video, and that's another creative use. I uh, shows you Rue water. That means mixing Florida water with Rue, or Rue, and you'll come out with uh, Rue water, dry it really, really good, and put it in here and mix it up, and it'll actually turn green. Um, it's already a bluish type color, but it'll turn green. Um, uh, let's see, bluish type color, and it actually turned green. And if you want to protect your, uh, it's a protection all around. So if you want to, you can add another herb to it, like mint or mugwort, to psychically protect you. Um, meant to protect your money and your finances. Um, ruin and needs to protect you against nightmares. Um, Rue and I think I'm gonna just hold up. Rose's petals. Um, I was gonna give you a whole crazy herb. <laughs> Damiana. And or rose petals, rose petals for women, Damiana for men, um, to protect your love, um, and the way you would actually apply this onto your lover or onto your luck is wash your wallet, your credit cards, your um, ATM cards, your money. Um, you would actually wash this. All of your money, like your, even your loose change and stuff, wash it all with rue water, and it would actually protect your money. Um, you could wash your doorknobs to protect your house. Um, you could add cut a little bit to your children's bath water. You know, actually protect your children. Um, you can add a little bit to um oh and you also can burn this and it would actually do that protection thing uh, um, so what it is is that it's an alcoholic based um alcohol based um cologne and the alcohol and it will strike the essence and the spirit from the herb. Now, some people would advise you to use fresh herb. I've tried to use fresh herb. Uh, it just takes a little longer to get the spirit out of it. <laughs> um, as the plant dies, then the oils and the oils and the essence, the smells, the essence, the oils, the essential oils will all run out of it and come out of it and turn the water green. So, I guess that's a uh, rue and in Florida water. That's one use for Florida water. I'll give you several uses for Florida water. Um, might do a couple of how to's on Florida water um, if you want to see something. A good cool trick. I'm gonna just add a little bit of Florida water inside of this um, thing right here. And so I'm gonna put this up here and uh, final lighter.